How's it going, Savage Life family? This is going to be a quick little video here, and I'm going to be showing you guys five cryptos to look out for that you should be buying the dip for. Now, if you saw my five picks before, it was the top five picks before October that you should buy, then you should all be in a profit now as two out of the five new coins are in this video and one of the video and one of the coins is solana so we're going to start off with solana it's currently at 193 dollars when i talked about it, it was at around 134 great buying opportunity but it seemingly smashed all time high today and it will continue to do so as time goes on as bitcoin continues to rally and correct solana will spike on those corrections so currently there's seven billion 486 million dollars in volume being moved around the solana very good because that means there's lots of activity and volatility and trading going on behind the scenes with a market cap of 58 billion dollars it seems like it's reached its peak but don't be quick on the finger or the trigger as they like to say because there is plenty of market cap to come for solana now for it to reach $400 price points, it would need to double its market cap being $116 billion. Is it possible to reach that market cap by year's end? I believe so as Solana is getting worldwide attention at the current moment. Look at the amount of members all across the board. Look at the amount of developments that have been built on this blockchain. It is through the roof and it's only the beginning. Now, for those of you who have not jumped into Solana and are looking for a great entry, I'd hold it off for the time being due to the fact that we are very close to resistance at the moment. If we bounce off the resistance, which is here at $198 and reject to the 170s, then that would be a great buying opportunity. But buying now would be like if you're buying the dip and trying to catch a falling knife, trying to catch that red candlestick while it continues. Now, seemingly if you're holding it for a long time and your dollar cost averaging, then it doesn't really matter the levels that you're buying in now because years down the road, this is going to be worth triple, quadruple the valuation of what it is currently worth at the moment. So ladies and gentlemen, for our next pick, we have FTX token here, which is priced at 60 two dollars it has a market cap of 7.4 billion dollars with a volume at four 580 million now the volume is quite low not much volatility at the current moment but once it picks up i'd see it at the 70 dollar price range within the next couple of days if not weeks i say this due to the massive adoption that ftx has been creating across the board so they have bought the miami heat arena as well as created sponsorships with multiple nfl teams nhl teams basketball teams you name it ftx is taking over and you wouldn't go wrong by owning a couple of these tokens for a prime example if you happen to buy microsoft back in the early 90s or 80s you would be in the same situation as ftx in the moment because microsoft has been buying companies since the early 2000s and this is what ftx is doing and i believe 10 years down the road ftx is going to have a majority if not over 60 percent of the graphs in the entire cryptocurrency industry as they had first hands now if we take a look at entry levels it seems now is even a great level to hop into ftx but there is possibilities of a rejection down to the lower 55 56 dollar price point levels which is where i would wait to personally hop in so if you are currently in a position to buy into ftx be in absolutely no hurry as there is lack in volume so there is no rally coming anytime soon within the next couple of days next on the list we have polka dot here ladies and gentlemen polka dot is sitting at 2.5 billion dollars in volume with a 42 billion dollar market cap is currently ranked number eight on the list and it caught me by surprise there i did not know polka dot was now ranked number eight but it definitely does deserves the spot as it is truly an innovating 
blockchain. Now, I like to diversify my portfolio, and if your portfolio is fully proof of stake, then you should think about diversifying into some proof of work coins or vice versa. And a proof of work coin, for an example, would be Ethereum, Bitcoin, Ethereum Classic, Litecoin. You can't go wrong having those in your portfolio. But Polkadot here is a proof of stake coin and it focuses on scalability and transaction speeds. It seems a majority of these newer tokens is their main focus on speed and scalability, but in doing so, they sacrifice security. So keep that in mind and that's why I advocate for diversification. So if we're looking for a great entry here at Polkadot, we can see there is a strong support level at $34.67. It just finishing forming a cup and handle formation here on the 14th of October. So it does look like it's prime for liftoff reaching those $50 price point levels in due time. So these key levels here, would it be a bad buying in opportunity from 40 to $43 as it is prime for takeoff. But keep in mind, if you're buying into any of these coins, think years down the road, think months down the road, even weeks down the road don't just try to make a quick buck and flip it in a matter of days because you'll look back in the future and wish you haven't done so next here we have sushi swap you're definitely going to want to have a swap point in your portfolio as sushi swap has been taking thrashing and a beating in the past couple of days and weeks it's currently ranked number 81 and it has a market cap of 1.3 billion with volume at 182 million the situation with sushi swap compared to pancake swap or any other swap is that it has much room for liftoff. For an example, if we just added $10 billion to its market cap, that is a 10X from its current price point, putting it above $100 in price. So you have much opportunity and much leg room for a takeoff as long as it gets the media attention that it deserves. Now, you guys let me know if you believe any other swap is better than Sushi Swap as an investment for the short to near term remember we're still in that rally and november and december is right around the corner for our last coin here we have algorand which is currently ranked 19 market cap at 11 billion dollars with 527 million dollars in its volume I personally buy Algorand every Friday. I pour about a hundred bucks into Algorand. It is a great project and the most eco-friendly blockchain ever made. So you definitely wouldn't want to go wrong with Algorand as there is hundreds of DeFi projects being built on the blockchain and it has plenty of room for growth. Yes, its market cap is sitting at 11 billion, but I, in my eyes, see it much more valuable than a coin like Cardano, for an example, which has $70 billion in its market cap. So time will only tell, and if it does receive some of Cardano's market share, it is prime for a liftoff. Now, when would be a good buying opportunity? Well, if you use my strategy and dollar cost average every week, that is the best strategy you can do when investing and especially something that's cheap like Algorand and has plenty of time for takeoff. This is not a project you want to sell anytime soon and it is a project you're going to want to have in your portfolio. But keep in mind, since it's lacking volume, we're not going to be seeing 50 cent jumps, 40 cent jumps for Algorand in days to come. So if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that like as it massively helps with the YouTube algorithm and subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. See ya.